Hey everyone, in this video, I'm going to be answering the question that's been coming up the most during my Instagram 14 2 in 1 videos. And that question is what's the difference between the 5406 and the 5410? Now, before we begin, I would like to ask everyone that's watching this video right now to consider doing me a favor, and that's to subscribe to my channel. You don't have to press the bell icon. It's free to subscribe and it will be helping me out a lot. By subscribing, you'll see my videos on your feed, but you won't get the notification as long as you don't press the bell icon. I make tech videos, automotive videos, and gaming. If you're interested in it, I do some gaming as well. I like to interact with my community and I would really like to start doing this as my full-time job. And if you want to help me do that, please just consider pressing that subscribe button. Like I said, it doesn't cost you anything and you'll be helping me out. The second thing I want to mention is thank you to all my supporters that are actually watching my videos right now and the main support that's coming to me right now is from India so everyone in India thank you so much for all your support that you're giving and thank you so much for interacting with my videos and asking me questions so I can try support and help you. I really appreciate what you guys are doing so thank you. The second country it's a kind of a toss up between Japan and the USA so that's the most honest combination I have so it's either the USA watching most of my videos or Japan so for everyone in Japan thank you so much for watching my videos I hope uh, it tells me that you're actually watching it with the subtitles on as well I hope the subtitles are translating properly and yeah if there are any questions please do ask me I'll try help as much as I can and for everyone else around the world thank you for clicking on my videos to actually watch it and you guys don't understand how much it actually affects my profile when you guys actually click on my videos and watch it and I, I really appreciate every single one of you guys that actually do that. I know it's a tech industry and you just want a different perspective. I really would like to do this as my full time job and provide the more support I can really. Um, so please do consider hitting that subscribe button. Um, like I said, it doesn't really cost you anything and it really helps me out. So without wasting any more of your time asking you to subscribe, uh, let's get on with it. So, what are the main differences? Got a bit of fingerprint marks on it. That's because I've been using that hell of a lot recently and I have to say I am super impressed with the 5410. All right, so the main differences between the Inspiron 5406 and the 5410 lays right here. So one, it has a micro SD card slot. By the way, this is the 5410. The 5406 has a normal SD card slot located here. The second difference is this. Oh, you're not able to see it that well. Right here, there's a webcam shutter. I show it in one of my videos, I'll link it up there. But that webcam shutter is one of the other main differences, right? It's a physical webcam shutter that you can control. The third difference is the air vents. They've actually taken more time into actually uh, redesigning the air vents to make them more effective. The third difference, or is this the fourth? This is the biggest difference between the 5406 and the 5410 and that's the compatibility with the pen. Don't forget the 5406 and the 5410 come as a clamshell and a two-in-one. So the two-in-one version is like this, right? The two-in-one, literally you can have it as a normal laptop or you can turn it into a uh, tablet. Now, the 5406 comes in the two form factors as well. However, the pen isn't always gonna be compatible with the device you have depending on the configuration you buy it in. However, the 5410, this one, as long as you get the two-in-one version, which is the version I have in here, the one that turns into a tablet, the pen will always work. So you can literally just buy this pen, you can simply draw. It's literally just take it out of the box and you can draw on the screen. So it's pen compatible with no issues at all on the 5410. However, the 5406, you may have some compatibility issues depending on the configuration you have. Just so you're aware and just in case the question comes down in the comment section, the version that doesn't work with the pen is the HD display version of the 5406. Those are literally the four, I think it was four, the four main differences between the 5406 and the 5410. Now before I end this video and please I hope you're still with me and I hope I have everything here, uh, I do. So. Um, what I'm going to be doing in this video, and it's just for this video, is I'm going to be giving away five uh, Dell Active Pens. So if you are interested in getting yourself one of these Active Pens, or you're interested in getting yourself one of these um, 5410 devices, I am giving away five pens to 
five lucky subscribers to my channel. And the way that you can enter to win this is very simple. All you have to do is subscribe to my channel through this video. Um, the other way for you to subscribe and to be in with a chance of winning is actually clicking on my channel itself and then subscribing from there. The analytic data actually tells me who subscribed from where, so I'll be able to identify you there. If you wanna make things easier for me to identify you if you're a winner, the best thing for you to do is uh, over here, I'll link my um, Instagram account. If you give me a follow on there and then message me your YouTube name, that will help me identify the two and link the two. And then I can actually message you on Instagram to tell you that you're a winner. Now this competition is available, not competition, this prize draw is available across the world. So no matter where you are, considering that India, you are my largest viewing base, I'm assuming most of the winners are gonna be from India, but I'll make it completely random. And yeah, so I'll be giving five of those away. And like I said, they work with the 5410. So if you are considering buying one of these devices, I would recommend that you just subscribe to the channel just to be in a chance of winning these pens. And yeah, uh, I wish you all the best of luck. And, and as always, if you have any questions, leave them below. My contact details are below as well. And I'll try and get back to you as soon as I can. Just a heads up, my son now actually gets his hands on my phone and does swipey swipey. Sometimes I don't see notifications, so if I do reply late, I'm really sorry. But I look forward to making the next video. If there are any questions that you have, do ask me and I'll try to reply in the comment section or I'll make a video on it, depending on how popular that question is. So there you have it. Those are the main differences between the 5406 and the 5410. And I'm giving away five active pens. Until the next one, guys. Peace out.